Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. So today we will be again discussing about the crop production and management. But before going to that, uh, just let me discuss it once again, the preparation of soil. I think you have understand it well and the in the comment box you have comment all the answers right and congratulations for that and today we will be discussing about showing seeds and adding manures and fertilizers to the field sowing seeds it's compiled of two processes selection of seeds and tools to sowing seeds also tools to sowing seeds can be of two type manual or by the help of machine now first we will go through how we select our seeds to select the seeds we need to take some water in a glass and put some seeds inside it good seeds will settle down at the bottom whereas the damaged one will float on the top surface and now we can segregate them easily after that we can sow those good seeds manually that you can see in the left hand side or by the help of seed drill but the process of doing it manually it's uh, not a wise idea why this is so because it could not be that much uniform right in the field the particular distance between seeds has to be maintained but by using seed drill we can do that very easily so we will discuss about seed drill and how seed drill is useful for showing seeds. Seed drill is actually compiled of three basic sections. One funnel type section where the seeds is been placed. After that a pipe is been attached to it through which the seeds come to the ground and a nozzle which is having a metallic end. That metallic end easily peers into the ground and place the seed inside the ground. So, we can see the benefit of using seed drill. See the field? It is so much uniformly spread with crops, right? That is because of use of seed drill. It uniformly spread the seeds inside the field. Now, I am having a homework question for you. Why this is so necessary showing seeds maintaining an appropriate distance? You have to answer it by your own. After that, the adding of manure and fertilizers. Now, what are these manures and fertilizers, these terms actually mean? Manures and fertilizers are that kind of substances which are added to the soil in form of nutrients for the healthy growth of the plants. These are called basically manures and fertilizers. But manures and fertilizers, they are having some differences between them. Let us discuss it one by one. First, we will take the definition of manure. Manure, as you can see in the left hand side of the slide, it is basically an organic substance. That obtained from the domestic, from your household also, you can decompose the wastage of your household or any kind of plant or animal wastage, right? So by decomposition, you can make manure by yourself only. And the advantage of using manure is very important. It add humus to the soil and not only that, it also make the soil very much fertile. It never hampered the fertility of the soil and that is the only drawback of fertilizer. Fertilizer are some chemical or inorganic substances which are very rich in plant nutrients and a very particular nutrients but they do not add any humus to the soil like manure and also it hampers the fertility of the soil. So if you regularly use fertilizer then the fertility of the soil will be hampered or disturbed, right? So there are some examples I have given. Urea, ammonia, sulfate, superphosphate. So these are some examples of fertilizers. And in comment box, you have to say one more fertilizer 
or example of one more fertilizer okay after that let us discuss about the differences between fertilizers and manures first one you can see the fertilizers are inorganic substances manures are organic substances right and fertilizers do not add any humus to the soil and manure add humus to the soil after that in case of fertilizer add, add are there as they are very much rich in plant nutrients like npk nitrogen phosphorus and potassium so they enhances the growth of plants but manure is relatively less rich in plant nutrients so apparently you can think about using fertilizer but in long term fertilizer is actually disturb the fertility of the soil so you can have good uh, quality of crop or good quality of plant but the soil the texture of soil will be disturbed by using fertilizer maybe the water holding capacity will also be disturbed using fertilizers but manure by by using manure you cannot have a very um, healthy looking or very um, glossy looking crop or vegetables but in long term it will not disturb the texture of the soil at all so one more and very basic example basic difference between fertilizer and manure is in the picture you have to study the picture and write down in the comment box what this picture is trying to say to you it's very easy i know you can see 